Hi there everyone and a welcome to my channel. I hope you're all having a fabulous day. So I recently did a bit of a shopping haul. I hit up Primark. I got a couple of little bits from TK Maxx which I will share with you as well but this is pretty much a Primark haul. I didn't buy loads because this, this, some of the stuff in Primark isn't as good as it used to be. Um, I wanted some of the, like the cotton face pads they didn't have those so um, I'm just going to share what I got from TK Maxx. I think I've got a dress out new look as well. Maybe I'll share that with you too. And um, just, yeah, just share what I got with you. Because I don't go shopping that often anymore. So I just thought I would share that with you. But if you do like these types of videos, then don't forget to like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Because it helps me out and I love it that you love my videos. So let's jump into it. So the first thing I got from TK Maxx was these like, uh, these like flat sh chunky shoes. Uh, these were a bit of a steal, they were 20 quid RRP 59.95 and they were in the sale, I don't know how much they originally were because TK Maxx always put a sticker over what they originally were really don't we? let's see if we can figure it out. Okay so it looks like they were about 25 quid, not a massive discount but a discount nonetheless and these, the soles in them were so soft and like comfy, well I don't know if they're comfy because I've not worn them yet but they're like squidgy like almost like memory foam and I've been looking for a pair of shoes like this for ages. Uh, they are refresh shoes so I'm hoping my feet don't stink, not that I'm saying my feet stink <laughs> but when you don't wear socks with shoes like this then they can get a little bit smeller so I'm hoping that they'll kind of like just be a bit refreshed if you know what I mean but yeah I have been looking for shoes like this for ages having very very small feet sometimes even the size three are too big uh, yes I am only size three sometimes I buy a two about the kids infant shoes because I am a tiny little dot and that is my life but yeah i am got some really nice outfits and bottle shoes okay so the next thing I got from TK Maxx was the heatless hair curlers wear to sleep natural morning curls now this was only eight quid now I know you can get these like off TikTok and places like that but while I was there and they were only eight quid I just I picked them up because now I've got my extensions in. I feel like I might be able to try this. So I'm excited to give them a go because I'm going out on Saturday. So I might um, wash my hair on Friday night and bob those in. I don't know yet though. I don't know. I might just straighten it. Who knows? You know, like sometimes you just, don't, you just don't know till the day, do you? That was pretty much it out of TK Maxx. Let's say it wasn't a massive haul and this isn't a huge haul. And from New Look, uh, they had like a clearance section. And I got this dress and it was down from £30 to £15. And I got the size 6. And it's just a plain like button dress with a wrap. I feel like I need to move backwards a little bit so that you can see. So it's just like a plain gold button dress and it's got like a wrap in the middle. So uh, yeah, that'll be lovely for like work or just going out for some drinks with some like maybe chunky boots. It's got a collar, so it's like a shirt dress. So yeah, it's like ideal just for in the office and every day. I think for £15 it's, it's not a bad deal really. Okay, so that was pretty much it from those two shops. So I'm just going to jump into the Primark bits now. I picked up some slippers. These like Ugg wannabe slippers. These were, they weren't that expensive. £9. I hate these, all these bits you get on them. Waste of plastic. Uh, but. I film in my she shed so I have to go from the house to my she shed and I always wear my slippers. Uh, I have got crocs and stuff but I, my feet don't stay warm in them when I'm in here if that makes sense. Uh, so I wanted something with a proper sole because if I go from the house to my shed in my slippers the bottoms of my feet are wet so I'm ending up wearing my crocs to here and then changing some slippers when I get here so this in here. So these would just be ideal for just walking from the house to the shed and back again and just keeping my feet lovely and warm and they're really really soft as well so yeah loving those. Okay so I did pick up some underwear bits as well I just picked up a pack of mini keks uh, seven quid just needed some new keks this is what I look like underneath it's not exciting they're granny knickers they're comfy and that's just how I live my life don't judge don't judge we all want a comfy brief but in the uncomfort, but these are not uncomfort. I've got one of these sets already and they used to do another set uh, that I didn't see there and like a bralette so I picked up black, grey and lilac, like a purpley lilac and they're, they're a thong 
but like a bralette and they've got adjustable straps now these sets are only six pound for the full set and they're so soft and for i picked up small in each one now i have a very small back but I've quite an ample boob i'm like a 30g so my back my boobs don't look that big but my back is quite small and the they are hook eye at the back as well they're not just you can you know adjust that and adjust the straps which I really really like because they do kind of they're comfortable they make me feel like I'm held in even though I have got big boobs um so I'm loving those and I've picked up three because they're just so comfortable they're ideal for summer as well I mean bras with underwires that are tight and they're like torture devices they are th I, it, it's got to have been a man that invented the bra let me know in the comments down below if you know who invented the bra but the, the first thing I do when I get home is I take my bra off and put my pyjamas on who else does that? so I did also picked up a, a couple oh, I also picked up a couple of reed diffusers one in peanut and one in vanilla now these used to be 80 pence but they're now a pound so I'm still not mad at it they do last a, a, a while they last a good few weeks last about 3-4 weeks and they smell lovely. I've def I've had not had the peony before, but I've had the vanilla, and the they are quite cute looking. Let me open one and show you. A little bottle. So obviously you get the reeds, and then you get a little bottle, and it's just a reed diffuser. But yeah, I think you know they're not a bad size. They are thirty mil, and they're quite you know quite nice looking for a pound. You can't beat that, can you? love them do love them okay so i did think i picked up the smaller rollers in these as well but obviously not but uh these are the velcro rollers velcro hair rollers they're only two pound fifty i really did think i picked up the larger size and the smaller size but obviously not i must have dreamt it but yeah excited to use those as well because they're like even though i've got my extensions in now uh, my hair is very very fine so i don't get a lot of volume Oh, I'm loving these nano ring hair extensions though. I've never had hair like, let's just zoom you out a little bit. I've never had hair so thick or long. I mean, you know, it's not that long compared to some people, but it is for me. But I've never had hair so thick and long in my life. And I'm just living the hair dream. It's like my hair goals have come true. So I just want a little bit of volume now. I want everything. Why can't I have everything? And I also picked up some exfoliating gloves. They're only £1.50 the two pairs now usually like a quid a pair so I thought that was all right uh, they don't feel that like they're gonna be that scrubby but they're gonna be scrubby enough and I also picked up uh, one accessory which was these gold hoops which I feel like I should have put in when I was filming this makeup look this makeup look I'll link it in the description box below but it's like the my take on like the mod wife look so yeah maybe I should have put those in because I don't really have any chunky gold jewelry and apparently that's the look I also picked up an umbrella and I know we're getting into spring but it's still gonna sit down uh, and I'm going to Venice a week on a week this coming Friday so I don't know if it's going to rain or not and my my decent umbrella just went it just broke so I bought this it was only £4.50 but I like the fact that it was quite compact so it's gonna not gonna be taking loads of room in my case I'm just gonna be able to bob it around my wrist and carry it around if it is raining you, you know it's not dead heavy I just wanted something and then if it does break while I'm there just leave it there it's only £4.50 lost it's not the end of the world I mean I don't want to lose £4.50 don't get me wrong I'd sooner to bring it back with me and use it in April because we all know it's gonna belt it down in April I mean I mean we do live in the UK could belt it down any time of the year but yeah handy 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 so clothes um, I did see these pyjama sets and said to my husband can I have those for Mother's Day and I, I only wanted I, well, I only said can I have one and he was like oh just get the two just get the two so I was like oh okay no <laughs> if you insist so these are Jersey uh, BF sets it says and the part the Primark Cares range and they're really soft and they're just like the classic pyjama, just classic pyjama. So we've got those with the long leg trousers. Uh, I pick up a small in everything, by the way. So those are the long leg trousers in like a like aqua blue. 
and then these are like a almost sea green and these are the shorts version so the, the the material is so so like soft and uh, lightweight that I feel like going into the heat of the summer because even if I mean comment down below if you agree with me even if it rains all summer in England because like last year we had an absolutely pants summer it rained and rained it was still bloody boiling it was still hot at night time but I felt like I needed some pajamas on and just like toss around the house and just you know uh, at night you're getting cozy and you're still waiting to watch the telly you still want to be cozy in the summer I just felt like they were ideal so that is them now I haven't tried any of these on yet I also got this like all in one sports suit it's a uh, oh, I can't even read that right in it's a, wor a Primark workout and I got a size small or small and this is it's a UK 10 to 12 now I would have got an extra small because it does look quite big to me but I feel like I can get away with it because I'm not I'm small but I'm not like that small so um yeah I think for a small it does look a little bit big but I picked up a small and I'm hoping for the best and this is like a little like sea green they did have like a lovely cream one but they didn't have my size they only had like a medium and large and extra large they didn't have any small or extra smalls which was absolutely good about which is why I ended up with this colour I wasn't the colour that I wanted really but then when I saw it I wanted it so it's got like a panel in it as well to I'm assuming to hold you in while you're bouncing around but yeah I think that in the summer with just like a shirt over the top of a t-shirt brilliant uh, it's not something that I'd work out in or just walk around in because you know I am middle-aged now I also picked up so like this with this picked up like a sweatshirt with that let me move back so like those together so this sweatshirt was 11 pounds and it's like a, a cut off sweatshirt but it's very very light very light so I feel like like in the night time in the summer that and that together with a pair of trainers ideal absolutely ideal and again I picked this up in a small yeah small which is a 10 to 12 um, but yeah loving that and last but not least the last thing I picked up was a long dress now I got one of these last year and I think I got it in blue but I think I got it from Pretty Little Thing I don't think it was Primark and this was £7 now this is like, uh, I'm, I am a bit scared that it's almost skin colour on me and I'm going to look like a mannequin when I put it on. But, again, if I put that with that, so even in like the spring, good, it's still a little bit chilly. That with that and some pumps. Ideal. Absolutely ideal. But, yeah, that was, oh no. I've got a setting spray. I've got a setting spray. Let me move back in, let me move back in. So I picked up a Prep and Perfect Refreshing Setting Spray with Aloe Vera, Nydra, Cinnamide and Pro Vitamin B5 and that was £5. Now I think the makeup in Primark has gone up quite a bit and I don't generally buy a lot of my Primark makeup. Not that I don't enjoy it, it's generally got a whole host of people round it and it's been absolutely destroyed. So I don't generally buy a lot of Primark makeup. I think I've only ever bought one Primark eyeshadow palette, but I've always loved the foundations and, and, and whatnot. Let's say it's always just bleeding destroyed when you get there. It's like teenage kids, little kids like <laughs> print all over the faces and whatnot. Uh, or, you know, every eyeshadow palette's broken. God knows what else. But yes, I'm excited to try that because I do have the Prep and Perfect primer and I like that. So I'm excited to try that. So yeah, that is it. That is my little mini haul. I hope you enjoyed it. If you do want to see more videos like this, then don't forget to hit like, subscribe, notification bell, all the good stuff. That just makes my absolute day. And I hope to see you in the next video, guys. Bye.